All right, guys, welcome back. We're back in the garage here with this Audi A4, Project A4. What we're gonna do on this video is we're gonna take out this crank bolt right there, crank bolt. So you can see that I got that little belt trick right here. So this thing is gonna go to loosen the bolt is uh, counterclockwise going left. So set up this belt on the right way so that this pulley is not gonna spin to the left. It would be steady. And uh, this is the setup on this idler pulley. It's just a random belt on the garage, just laying around. Just grab them, put them here. Um, everything is all non untouched, like the tensioner and the timing chain still in there. This is why I'm taking out this crank bolt so I could work on a timing change and stuff and maybe take out the head. So this is the first step. So if you guys are new to this channel, make sure to subscribe and like this video. Get the subscribes people to come up and uh, learn, save money. So I'll show you how this thing done. Here we go. First, you're going to need a flexible strong arm. Okay, and then there's uh, two sockets that fits on that bolt, crank bolt. Um, you could use 24. Nice and snug, or you can use uh, 15, 16. It looks the same. So I'm gonna use 15, 16 on that one. Okay, here we go. Um, make sure it's nice and square off on the belt. We're gonna, after taking out this bolt, we're gonna set this to a TBC anyway. So doesn't matter if the whole engine will turn, doesn't matter. You're gonna just need to take out this crank pulley off and then we'll, when it turns, we can still set it up. So TBC. So there you go, when we're spinning it, they would compress that belt that would hold this whole pulley together. And here we go to see if this really work. Yes, she's loose, baby. She is loose. Look at that. We're gonna finish it off with the impact. Just like that. Don't need the belt. Look at that. Easy peasy. It's off. That easy. And then here's the crank pulley. So this crank pulley only go one way. You can see little small grooves are here. And then there's a big groove right there. So you line up the big groove to the crank. And that's how you do it. There's no keyway or anything on there. You just need to line up that big groove to the big groove on the crank and she's all good. That's it guys. Easy. <laughs> 